Hello everyone, Alex Smith here, <coughs> and today I'm back with another video from the series of how to make a functioning piggy map. I believe this is part four. Oh, and I just picked up the red key card, which is somehow called blue. Okay, so today we are actually going to be making the map. So let's get started. So I've got the link to this kit in the description below. I'm just going to show you how it works. So I'm just going to use the red key card. And what you need to do is you need to walk over an item, and that, and now you actually have it. Like with you have it, um, when you just walk over it, and I never knew how to do that before until I learned about touch interests. And you just got the hammer now. I need to fix, I'm going to show you how to fix what happens with the plank on the so I just grabbed the purple and the yellow key. You can use the yellow key on the safe and on the door. Like some of these are just little snippets from my other videos. So four, which is my slot four for my um, inventory, is the purple key. <coughs> so yeah, this is our template for our map, and we're going to be making it today. So let's get started. So what you need to do is once you've got the kit in, you want to right click ungroup. And now you should have the item bench, the hammer, the purple key, the yellow key. Um, the keycard doors are all the same, have just one model. There's the n normal working door. Next video we'll be doing crouching. So we've got the vent, we've got both the safes, <coughs> we've got the board door, the hammer warning and the key doors. So how to fix this is we actually need to drag the plank just into the workspace and that's basically all we need to do to fix that. So, so far I'll just give you a quick recap. We've got the safes and key doors, you've got the <coughs> decorations and you've got the morphs. So that's just a little quick re recap. <clears throat> so now what you want to do is you just want to make like a quick decoration for the map like maybe just extend the platform so I'm I'm just gonna make my map very quick but but basically we're going to make the walls I'm just gonna make the walls wood just to make it a little bit unique um that looks quite nice. I'm just going to make them wood planks. You can make whatever map you want. I'm just going to make a little quick one. So I'm just going to um, <coughs> make this a little room. I'll probably make NPCs at some point. But I've got some big news about this series. This is actually going to be turning into a how to make a piggy game. But it's as simple as possible. And it's going to be, um, it's not going to be exactly like Piggy, but it's going to be as simple as I can make it. Which is going to be quite fun. So, what we're going to, I'm just going to make it so that you need the, um, that you need the red key. This is obviously the most fun part, actually making the map. But you're going to need the red key card to get in here. So, to make the doors, you basically just need to, um, make a door little shape in the wall with parts and then you just need to go and grab the door from the kit what you can do is to make a different colored keycard door you just need to go into the model um, change the color of the keycard and just maybe like change and maybe change like the colour of the glowy bit on the keycard door and that's basically how you change the colour keycard like I've only provided for you red and blue but you can make whatever colour you want so I'm actually going to um, make the red keycard <coughs> over here 
and once you get him, there's going to be, um, this is the funnest part. So you're going to grab, you're going to get the purple safe and the purple key. Once you open this room, like I say, you can decorate this however you want. So then we're just going to grab the purple. So this is definitely the funnest part of this whole series. No scripting so far. So then we're just going to grab the purple key. We're going to put it with the purple safe. And I'm going to make it so that when you open the purple safe, you, I don't know, get the hammer. So like I said, um, so basically, I need, I'm just going to give him credit this time. But in the crouching video, I will use um, Footy Jules 1 2 Freeze Kit, or as he's known on YouTube, Grizzly Bear. And as, he's used to, and, he, and as he was used to be known on YouTube, Jules Blocks. He's a really good guy, so you can go subscribe to him. So, well, you can make sure everything's anchored. But, once you've anchored everything, what you need to do before it actually works is go to the keycard door, you need to go to the blue keycard and you need to unanchor the handle and you need to do it with both of them. That's, that's how you basically unanchor them. Um, so, yeah, let's play the game and you're in your map. So I'm just going to go and see it. So we're going to grab the red key card. We're going to run into this door and we can open it. <coughs> grab the purple key, open the purple safe and grab the hammer. Yeah, so this actually works as a functioning piggy map. So this kit is a big one. So I and this video is probably the most whopping one out of them all. So I hope you enjoy. Oh, I forgot to actually show you what the um, normal door does. Well, if you play Piggy, then you'll know. But basically, what it does is just your mouse changes and you can click it and it opens. And actually, what's neat on these keycard doors is when you hover your mouse over the bit where you use the keycard, it turns into a little lock. I don't know how you do that on like the safes and stuff. So yeah, well, as you can see, we I can't actually walk through the vent. We're going to have to um crouch to get through there. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video. On the way to getting the kit, make sure to like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.